Hey guys, we're Blind Way Back. I'm Eric. I'm Kevin. I'm Rick. Shane. Eric. And we are here with a little Blind Wave mailbag uh, mini game that Moon mm -hmm. uh, sent us in mailbag. Yes, it is basically a guessing game where we are each trying to guess what is in the package as well as get the package that is destined for us. Okay. We're going to do so by rolling some dice, which will give us some points, which we can spend on clues. Okay. So we each need to roll 2d6 to see who goes first to get the highest number. Eight for me. Four, Four for me. Nine. Nine. Eight. And thank you, Amber B, for the dice. We're getting yes. <laughs> Three. Right. Oh, Rick goes first. So I will go first. The players will then choose whichever box prize seems the most appealing to them in order that was decided on. So we'll just be me, and then we'll go this way? Sure. All right. Sure, shall we last? So I am thinking number four. This is this one. Yep. Is for you? That's the one he's going for. I am going to go for... Can I handle them before I pick? I suppose so. You're gonna shake them. So each of these also has a destined member that they, yes. are, they are meant for. Which we will find out after the game is over. Okay. Hmm. Yeah. I'm gonna choose number one. Okay. See, I was thinking that I was gonna pick number three because it's one of my favorite numbers. But then I was like, you know what? I'm, I was probably sent the smallest package. <laughs> <laughs> So I'll take the second smallest package. I'll, I'll take uh, the one closest to me. Three. So don't look at those yet. So Shane, you get five. Okay, each player will roll the dice on their turn, By depending the on the numbers shown. And look, the cards are amazing. I know. Yes. They're very well the made. Cards are <coughs> great. Yeah. All right, so I will roll. I get a two, which gets me plus two points. So I can save those points, or I can use them to buy something. You can buy a chance card for... Three points and a clue card for two. So I'm going to go ahead and blah, buy a clue card. Okay. I need a chance cube. Mm. Maybe a wizard. Chance cube. Huh? All right. Do you read it? I'm going to read it. This item was created to keep wizards hydrated. That is my clue. So now the turn moves to Calvin. All right, Calvin, roll the die. A one. You skip your turn. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Six. Is that good? Plus four points. Woo, baby! So with those points, you can spend three to buy a chance card or two to buy a clue card. What is a chance card? Take chance. a chance on me. All right, let me, let me get a chance card. Ain't nobody done one of those yet. All right, so you spend three points. Woo! So one point still left. has one. High roller, make a bet to activate this card. Bet as many points as you wish. Minimum of three. Minimum of three. Okay. okay. So he still keeps his points? So it's, when I want to activate that, I make a bet and I bet my points. Okay. And then I... What do I make a bet at? Uh, so make a bet to activate this card. Roll the dice three times. If you get even numbers on all three rolls, you get as many points as you rolled in total. If you roll odd numbers on all three rolls, you lose the points you bet. If you roll two even and then one odd, you get as many points as you bet. If you roll two odd and one even, you lose as many points as the last number rolled. Oh, okay. So I can do that later, though. Yep. Yes. Because I only have one point right now. Yeah. So Eric. No. Oh, yeah. Keep that in there. Five. Uh, minus two points. Can you go negative? It does not say. What? <laughs> I'm just going to assume that yes. What? <laughs> minus two. Okay. Jane. <laughs> oh, what? Three. Minus one point. So you want to roll low? Uh, now you want to roll a two, a four, or a six. You want to roll okay. even. Yeah. Yeah, even is what you want. Okay. Uh, get a clue card. If you already have all two clue cards, you get three points. So, uh, take a zip. Take a zip to easy the struggle. It's way too fancy to fall in the hands of a muggle. So some sort of Harry Potter related drink. Is it supposed to be zip or sip? I think it's supposed to be sip, but it says zip. But I don't know. Maybe it is. The yes and Z are pretty far apart. It's your turn. Take a sip to ease the Not struggle. Not on the keyboard, though. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, Z's here. Shit. Mm. <laughs> okay. All right. <laughs> You're done now, right, Rick? Yeah, I'm done. Different fingers, though. Four. Four. You type like Rick. You get a clue card, right? Uh, yeah. Yep. All right, number one. It might be faux leather, but holds it together. Works like a charm. 
keep it from harm. Uh, kangaroo ball sack. Another one. <laughs> it's not faux. <laughs> it's not faux leather at all. Kangaroo ball. <laughs> Two. Two points. So I got three points. Yep, so you can bet if you wanted. No, I'm going to get a clue card. Two oh, points. Punch so I'll keep it at one point then. Okay. For the time to take the throne, you might want to have your own. A sword hmm. from the Lady Life. Three. Minus one point. Okay. <laughs> Great game. <laughs> Six. Six. Plus four points. Yeah, four points, Shane. So, Shane, you can buy a clue card or a chance card. Or save them. Wait, what, what, what are the advantages of saving the points? Whoever has the most points at the end of the game wins. Yeah. Same. But if you can guess your box correctly, you get plus ten points. I'll take a card. All right, so minus... Uh, the, these are two points. These are three points. Okay. I'll take one of these. Okay. Okay. That will be now yep. out loud? Mm-hmm. When your confidence is zero... When your confidence is zero, this will make you a hero. Oh, she made all these riddles. Or he. They. They, they made all these riddles. All right, Rick, roll. Roll dice. Oh, skip turn. <laughs> three. Three. Minus one point. <gasps> Why? It's your turn. All right, Eric, your turn. <coughs> two. Plus two points. You get two points. All right. Now you're at minus one. Yay! Yay. So <laughs> can you go negative? Should that be a thing? I don't know. It doesn't say. I'm going to say you can't. Eric, you have two points. All right. You want to buy a clue card or you want to move on? Um, I'll buy a clue card for box three. If you can smash, take this in a flash. Could be Smash oh. Brothers or Flash related. Or a condom. What? That's a that's a small condom. <laughs> Moving on. That? <laughs> it's like a mega boss. <laughs> Maybe for you, Calvin. So what happens if I <laughs> try to guess? You can't guess. There's until no guessing can't. until all these cards are gone. Yeah, so roll and take seven. Three. Minus two points. Minus one. Minus one. Points one. Now? Zero. Well, you have zero now. Uh, gain a clue card. If you already have two clue cards, gain plus three points, which I will use on a chance card. Okay. Slap chance! What? <laughs> okay. Uh, you get one point for every slap you take. What? You can choose the number of slaps you take. If you give up before the number of slaps, you <laughs> lose three points. Okay. <laughs> Assign a number one to five for each member. Roll the dice to choose the slapper. If you get your own number or a six, the chance is over, and you get as many points as the slaps you chose. Max number of slaps allowed is 10. Okay. You doing it, Rick? Um. It ain't gonna be no fucking podcast slap here. No. This is for blood, brother. <laughs> <laughs> we want you to say no more. <laughs> no, you gotta say no more. Playing, playing All mercy, right? right? All right, I will take, I will bet three. So three points? Yeah. Three slaps? So one, two, three, four, five. Okay. All right. And you roll. One. Eric. Oh, Eric. <laughs> I need to slap you? Yeah. Number one, yeah. Sweet. Okay. So that's, so. Is, does he slap you three times then? Is that what the rule no, is? No, no, no. Uh, no, he slaps me and then Eric, I roll again. You're setting the tone here. Uh, <laughs> Eric, okay. you're setting the tone. Are you ready? Oh! <laughs> that didn't hurt. I can tell. What? It, it, looks like it didn't feel great. It like a, that was a good slap. Six. That means you can just yes. get your points. If you get your own number or a six, it is over and you get as many points as yeah, the I, slaps you chose. So I get three points. Okay. okay. Let me see that. That's I feel like Eric slaps you three times. So I, think so Eric times. Once. I think Eric needs to slap you two more right. times. It's Shane's fault. Oh, oh Jesus. I'm sorry. All right, there's one more. You got one more you slap. Got, you want to yeah. do it? Yeah. I don't need to do a hurt because it's got one more, but ah. it's really going out. I'm sorry, my ah. Oh, Jesus. Jeez. Oh, I'm sorry. Jesus. I'm sorry. That's exactly. I didn't want to do this. If your first one was like that, you might not have done it. Uh -huh. Maybe. But by the time you're the third one, you might as well finish. Yeah. Oh, geez. sorry. Okay. Three points. I'll buy another card. Rick's pissed. <laughs> All right. Look what you guys have done. Exchange. You get to trade gifts with the person of your choice. Oh. Well, Eric is the Harry Potter guy. I think, right? Well, you don't want to give him his own gift, then. Of this group. Oh, probably. yeah, that's right. Yeah, you don't. But I want to get mine. True, but which one do you think is yours? I'm going to switch. Wishy. Oh, 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 o
A six. six. Plus four points. All right. So if we're going to zero. So we get four points. Okay. I have four points. I'm going to buy my other uh, clue card. That kind of hurts. I'm sorry. Uh, <laughs> to try, uh, try to catch your breath when traveling far and wide, a horse may be of help when the journey is long and wild. A saddlebag. Four. Clue card? Clue. You will need these when you go through the gate. Quality makes a difference when they might decide your fate. Okay. And that's it. Eric. Mm, time to take the throne. I put it in my clothes! Toilet paper. Four. Uh, get a clue card. Just another one? The, yep. Mm-hmm. The last one. Okay. Uh, it might be good if you can switch. Okay. Okay. <laughs> so if you can smash, take this in a flash. It might be good if you can switch. Like, maybe. Is it a case? I'm giving no one any hints, and they're not allowed to read my stuff. <laughs> Your turn, Jane. Roll the die. <clears throat> Six. Four Plus points. four points. Okay. Five. So you already have both clues. I will not do anything. Okay. Okay. Four points. Two points. So not enough to buy one of those. Oh, but I do have enough for this, because I have Shane's box now. So whenever you need that little extra, this will help you go plus ultra! This, you're so easy. What? <laughs> uh, five. Minus two points, is that what it is? Five? Uh, five is minus two points. Zero anyway. Two. Plus two. Plus two points? Yep. How many points do I have? You have three, so you have enough for this. <clears throat> Let me buy a chance, yeah. <clears throat> Inspector, you can take a closer look at everyone's gifts. Pick them up, feel them, smell them. You can do anything but look inside. If you're happy with your inspection, you can choose the one you like best and trade the owner. If you're happy with your own gift, you can only sell this chance card for three points and be invulnerable to inspections or trade trades when used by the buyer. Ooh. <clears throat> Six Ooh, plus points. four. I had choose. Uh, I'll do a chance cube. Did he get six points? He's got three now. Lucky roll. <laughs> oh, roll two dice for a chance to get points. You get the corresponding number of points for any even number and lose that many points for any odd number. Ooh. Do you want to do it now? You can choose to not take this action and discard the card. Uh, I'll do it. Okay. What is it? So roll the dice. You get points equal to even... The, the even die, if there is one, and negative points equal to the odd die. Eight. Eight, Eight points! Fours. Oh, the swings! Well, I think you can buy more cards, or you can pass. Um, I will, uh, get another chance card. Chance card. Okay. So, minus three. Discount. You get to pay two points for a clue card, or get a free roll on your next turn. What's a free roll? I guess you just get to roll again. <laughs> okay. And add it up, or take the bigger one. All right, well, I already have my clue card, it's so... like take two turns in a row, and do the free roll on my next turn, so... Your turn. Plus two. I will not buy a card. One. <laughs> Is it your turn? <laughs> huh? Okay. Rick skipped. <laughs> Plus you, four. You skipped Rick, and then when it was your turn, you gave it to me. You skipped yourself. You want a card? Yeah. I assumed right. that, like... We got one more card left. card was being skipped or something. Thief. Steal one of the other player's chance cards. Hmm. The stolen card can only be played on your next round. So, discount. <coughs> I steal. <coughs> Steely steal. All right, Aaron. You have one point. Yep. Two. Uh, plus two. Two points. So not enough to do anything. Eric! Five. Minus two. Yep. It's okay, you're not hurting. For my face! Five. Minus, minus two. Minus two. Right, two points. Shane. Jesus. Three points. Get three. Last card! <clears throat> Trader! 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 You can trade your gift with a person directly to your right or left, but only if that person agrees to do so. If the trade is successful, you both get plus two points. Nope. So, since we have all the cards, um, players will decide how many extra rounds they wish to do after all the chance and clue cards are used. 
Once the rounds are over, each player will have a chance to guess what is ex exactly in their box. I'm trying to think of which of these would be like for me. You know what I mean? Like destined for me. Mm. Based on. Oh, if it's mine, I'll give it to you. <laughs> no, that's not what I mean. I mean, like, I get more points if I get my destined package. <clears throat> oh, yeah. Yeah. But, like, I don't know. I feel like. I feel like none of the clues point to me. <laughs> I have no idea. Well, if no one wants to use any of their cards, then we could keep rolling for points, or we could end the game and guess. I do not wish to use my card. Me either. Well, let me just sell this for three points. Okay. Right? Yep. So that puts me at how many? Five? Yeah. And I'll do my high roller bet thing. Make a bet, activate this card, bet as many points as you wish. So roll... I roll two of these? What I think it's three, three. Three dice? Yeah. I'll just bet my five points. Okay. I forget what happens. You need... You want all evens. Three? It's an odd. So three is an odd. One. One is an odd. Damn it, that, I'm just fucked now. Two. So, so two, two odds and one even, you lose as many points as the last number rolled. So you lose two points. I lose two points, I have two points. All right. So, since I started first, I guess I will guess the object and the theme correctly. Well, the theme, My Hero Academia. Okay. Is going to be my theme. My object is going to be a blanket. Okay. Let's see. It's a hoodie. Got a hoodie. Ah. Pretty close. Yeah, what were you whispering? I said cape. I said I was my hero cape. I thought you said a game. It's a UA trick. Hoodie. hoodie. That's awesome. That's yeah. awesome. Yeah. Uh, so I get plus five points for the theme, but not plus five points for the object. It's not gotcha. Like it. All okay. right. So you have <clears throat> five points in total. Okay, and then sweet. After all this is over, we'll reveal what went to who. Okay. So, Calvin. All right. You eating it? No. <laughs> He's tonguing it. Like a woodwind. I think this is a Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. What are your clues again? Try to catch your breath when traveling far and wide. A horse may help be of help when the journey is long and wild. Mm -hmm. It may be faux leather, but holds together like a charm to keep you from harm. Gotcha. Um, a game case. Open her up. Oh. Switch. Switch. It's Breath of the Wild. Exactly what I thought it was. Hybrid ah, cover. It's a hybrid for cover. The switch. It's a switch so, case. I'm it's a, a switch case, pretty, not a pretty, game. Pretty, case. Pretty, pretty damn close. Hey, it's close. Glenn keeps you warm, hoodie keeps you warm. You didn't get warm. <laughs> That's different. <laughs> it's a game. It's for a game console. That is case. very nice. It also yeah. will hold it up as well. Mm -hmm. Uh huh. Stand. I'd give it to you, Calvin. I would. 100%. Jane? It's a game case. Is that Air Nix? It's a no. game console. Not a uh, game. Well, game console case. Would you give Calvin the yeah. points or not? It's for a Switch, though. I have, I have cases that are for I games. Definitely. And I have it. cases that are for my game consoles. They're different. You know? Um, if the stakes were higher, probably not. <laughs> the stakes were <laughs> higher. <laughs> I don't want to be a. You know, honestly, like, that is a console. If, if, if it was like an Xbox, would we give it to him? Like, probably not. Like, if it was like a backpack to carry your Xbox for, for in, For a no. game console? But if it was like for, if it was like a yeah. case to put like your games in, like that sword that you got for Z Zelda, like that's a game. But case. like if some game. old guy would be like, that's a game, 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 right? That's what he would do. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I think I would say no, but let us know in the comments what you think. Uh, I don't know. <sighs> I think I have the hardest one. I think I have an idea of what everyone else has. So Calvin has six points. I have this little box here. It says, for the time to take the throne, you might want to have your own. Which makes you think of, like, a crown or something like that, right? You know what I mean? <laughs> well, that's kind of thinking of Game of Thrones. Then you will need these when you go through the gate. Quality makes a difference when they might decide your fate. Then you think of either A, keys, B, dice. Brass balls. What? <laughs> Cajones. So my... I have an idea. Seems so you need theme and object. It seems soft. I feel like I'm going to lose this terribly. <laughs> but maybe this is supposed to be mine and to give me points that no one else gets. If you get one or the other, you're ahead of Calvin and I. I feel like it might be Game of Thrones. Is there anything I can think of with like a throne? I... You will need these when you go through the gate. Quality makes a difference when you might decide your fate. I really don't know. 
I don't know. When they decide your fate, I'll go with some kind of dice or cards. Oh. I think I know what it is. <clears throat> I know what it is. Do you? I do. <laughs> I know what it is. <laughs> After you guess, but before you open, I want to guess. Um, I'm going to stick with Game of Thrones, because I don't know what else. And I'm going to say cards. I don't know. Okay. If you guess the exact Greg, what you, same what do you think it is? thing as it is, the you Witcher, get bonus two points. <laughs> and it's going to be Gwent cards, because the game Thronebreaker is a story game where you play Gwent That would make sense, because I have no idea. What the hell? This must be... Not the box yeah. that it goes in. Like, <laughs> my balls! My balls! Like, man, we were way off. <laughs> no points! <laughs> oh, hope Aaron was exactly right. Well, there's probably cards in there. I'm hoping it's cards. Maybe I'm at least right with the item, but not the... D&D &D dice? Oh. Damn it! Ooh, those, those are, are gorgeous. Though. Go Wait, what's the theme? Just D and D. D and D. Damn you got it! None of them right. Damn it! Right. What an awesome gift. That is that is incredible. Can I? Uh, should, yeah. Oh, uh, look at those dice. Yeah, show them. Those are amazing. Mm, gorgeous. Just, just show the case around. Show it. Black and gold. Yeah. Damn it. Damn those it. Shitty pencils out of there. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> Dude, Hella awesome, yeah. dude. Hella They're awesome. Very nice dice. I love those. Gorgeous. All right, Eric. Okay. Uh, my clues are: if you can smash, take this in a flash. It might be good if you can switch. So. I've already gotten one switch related thing. Yeah, no. It can't be enough. Like I'm looking at all these. I'm like, uh, you don't think? Which ones is destined for who? You know. You're very careful with your language here, Eric. <laughs> so I'm gonna guess uh, like a. Nintendo Switch carrying case, maybe? Okay. That is what theme? Carry, yeah. Uh, I, don't, I mean, it just, if you can smash, like Super Smash Brothers, take this in a flash, so it might be good if you can it, switch. It, I'm not sure about if it has, like, a franchise theme. I, don't I mean, know everything about. has a theme. So you got to get a theme yeah. tonight. Um, well, it's not going to be a flash switch case. <laughs> so uh, I'll just say Super Smash Brothers as a general thing then. Okay. Smash okay. Brothers, like a Switch yeah. case. Any, ca any franchise that appears in Super Smash Brothers <laughs> is included. <laughs> All right. What? I don't I'm, know I'm, what I'm, you I'm, I'm kidding. No, I, Shane looks at me and goes, I have no what idea. Who are you left? Huh? What? Rick told me you guys were right. fighting. Look at me go. It is a Super Smash Brothers Switch carrying case. Damn it. <laughs> 10 points. Good job. Eric is at 16. It's really fucking it's awesome gorgeous. because look at the back. Yeah, oh, that's oh their my. texture. <laughs> that's really that. fucking cool, I need to man. find one. There's Ganon. Yes. Open it up. Open it up. And inside is a Nintendo Switch. No, there's <sighs> Oh man, the inside's sweet. Yeah, it's yeah, one, it is. It's one of the extra thick ones that you can put all the games and stuff in. And in case I did say that it was a game cover, you can put games in here. Too. That's true. You said switch carrying case. I'll take yeah, yeah. that as a switch carrying case. We'll take it. All right. Nice awesome. Love it. Well, yeah. technically, you can store a game inside of your switch, so it also holds a game. <laughs> <laughs> well, I believe it's Harry Potter themed. Um, You're going for second place. You cannot possibly get first. Well, it's also, Unless it's, it's also who him. it belongs to. That's true. Yeah, that's not right. Which I don't think so. I think that was first. So I was going to guess. I was well, thinking... I'm, it's first, right? I, I was thinking right? some kind of... Uh, drink holder. Okay. Uh, it's like a cup. Or like a... A Harry Potter version. Of that. I, I was thinking flask, but I don't know what the Harry Potter version that's called. Goblet? I would, have... I would accept drinking vessel sure. as an object. Okay. Yeah. Something you can drink. It honestly feels like a vase. Like it feels bigger and it feels like it's smaller. <laughs> like it feels like a, like a vase. Or a wine cup. Or a uh, chalice. Alright, so Harry Potter yeah. drinking vessel. Yeah. Drinking vessel. Light bulbs! <laughs> Another one! I love the wrapping paper, by the way. Hmm. Yeah. It's great. We just had to tear it up because we loved it so much. I remember, like, like, every two years, like, you know, my mom, like, you use wrapping paper. So, like, on the second year, like, all the wrapping paper so fucked up and wrinkled and there's tape all over it. Yeah. So she recycled it. Ten points! 
Oh yeah. Yeah. Harry Potter, uh, like a coffee mug. Gorgeous. Yeah. yeah. All right, so let's see who, Very nice. Very nice. what belongs to who. Yeah. Box number one, answer Nintendo Switch leather cover, plus 10 points if Eric chose it. That one, yep. That was this one. Yep. Box number two, set of metal dice for D&D, 10 points if Rick chose them. Yep. Box number three, Smash Brothers Nintendo Switch case, plus 10 points if Aaron chose it. Oh. Damn it. Four, Harry Potter travel mug, plus 10 points if Shane chose it. What? What? Oh. what? Holy shit. And My Hero Academia jacket. Shut up! <laughs> <laughs> my Hero Academia jacket slash uniform box five plus ten points if Calvin chose Calvin it. Okay. Uh, okay. You might choose to keep the prizes you won or trade them around. It is up to you. I legitimately I have this. Like yeah. This exact one. I legitimately want this. <laughs> but so you might choose. I don't know if that means you have to or if the other person disagrees. I don't know. This was a kind of a lot of fun, I yeah. say, yeah. Oh, man, it's really deep. Oh, it fits great. Thank you. I was I figured it was going to be yours with how small it was. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Mine or Rick's. <clears throat> All right, uh, who, what was the name? Um, Moon. 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 Moon, thank you very much for the game. That was and the concussion. Fun. Was there a, like, <laughs> thank Eric for I that. I thought it was like a last package <laughs> for like Eric. That's based on who wins, not for Eric. Oh, okay. There's I thought a, you won, uh, didn't he? Huh? You won. You, oh. you won. You did the dive. That's why you did the dive? I didn't know I accumulated that many points, but I was in first place. You're well, 24 you, points. You got what it was, and then you got 10 more points for the yeah, okay. for the being yours. Yeah. Which surprised me because I didn't think the Harry Potter thing was yours. I don't no, think I so either. Either. I love Harry Potter. But it's Gryffindor as well. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Which is Eric's. Wait, he didn't say Gryffindor. We all know that. Minus five points. <laughs> <laughs> he still would have won. It's not Gryffindor. No, he wouldn't. Have. It has the entire yeah. Oh, it's oh, it's oh. just in Gryffindor. It's just the it's colors. Red. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah, they they have the Gryffindor colors. Well, these Christ, are really awesome gifts. Well, thank you, Moon. Absolutely. Yeah. But thank you so much. Thank you, Amber B, for the dice. Yeah. Yes. Thank you. This was a lot of fun. Yeah. I love it. I don't know why. <laughs> Without I, I Amber, like the, I like the guest stuff. No way we could have played. I hated my clues. <laughs> 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 I, I was. When it had the part about the decide your fate, I'm like, dice, maybe. I was like, ooh, maybe cards, because it felt soft. I'm like, it could be cards, possibly. But I had no idea with the, for the time to, for for the time to take the throne, you might want to have your own. It just rhymes. I had no clue. Game what... throne didn't matter. They just threw me off. Yeah. <laughs> I had no clue what well, mine was until I realized. Mine says I, don't plus he, ultra. I don't know if he meant to do the throne thing, but if you were going Game of Thrones, who created the te television show, D&D? &D? I don't know. Maybe. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, that's true. All your guys have said the franchise in it. <laughs> yeah, mine had breath of and wild all, all capitalized. capitalized. Yeah. This said smash. Yours says Muggle. plus ultra. And what did yours say? Wizards Muggle. and Muggle. Wizards and Muggles. Yeah. yeah. Like mine, I'm like I have no idea. <laughs> if it didn't say if it didn't say Muggle, you could say well it could be many different things with wizards, you know. Yeah. <clears throat> it could be Star Wars. But chance for me, I was like it's it's a set of dice of some sort. Well, thank you, Moon. Thank you, Moon. For the gifts. Yeah, thank you very the memories much. Memories and the concussion. <laughs> appreciate it. Thank you, Moon. Thank you, everybody. Moon, thank for you. For watching. We appreciate it. If you guys want to see more mailbag, make sure you guys check out every Sunday. We have a mailbag that comes out. Subscribe. Don't miss out on it. And you can find more game night game nights um, on Sunday as well. Yeah. Every other Sunday. This will never be played again. It can't be. Impossible. Legacy game. I lost. Yep.